On Undetected Footprints, we are talking about 23-year-old Nicole Coleman. She met a tragic fate in Austin, Texas on December 31st of 2018. Her body was discovered in a wooded area near the 7,000 block of Ed Bluestein Road. She was found deceased, nude and with obvious trauma. Nicole had moved from Houston to Austin to seek help with her mental health. Just three days before her murder, surveillance cameras captured her walking across the parking lot at the Cool Corner gas station. Detectives continued to investigate, hoping that advancements in DNA technology might lead them to the person responsible for this heinous crime. Her family lives in fear, knowing her killer remains at large and others could be in danger. Up next on KVUE News, they are talking about Nicole's case and speaking to her mother. Let's take a look. In our KVU Crime Files, the call that a parent hopes they never get. But five years ago on New Year's Eve, a Houston mom got that call. Her daughter's body was found in the woods in East Austin. KVU's Ivan Nava sat down with the family of Nicole Coleman to find out more about her still unsolved murder. She was really tender-hearted. That's what I was trying to say, tender-hearted, that's right. She just, yeah, felt so happy and comfortable around her. She was a wonderful writer and poet. For Grandma Jillian and Mom Dawn, there are not enough words to describe how special Nicole Coleman was. A bright 4.0 college student who in her teens started struggling with her mental health. And as time went on, she would have episodes where she was paranoid, where she was terrified, and you couldn't really comfort her because she was living in her own reality. In November of 2018, Nicole moved from Houston to Austin to get help. She was living in a duplex off Arnold Drive. On December 31st, at approximately 5.36 p.m., 911 received a call. A cyclist and a walker were cutting through the woods on a hike and bike trail off at Bluestein Boulevard when they stumbled upon Nicole's body in the brush about 50 yards off 183. She was found deceased, um, nude, with obvious trauma. And I know someone, someone out there must have seen something. We went yesterday to see where she was found. It's busy. It's, it's not, you know, out, out. It's a busy road. This cool corner at Maynard and Northwest Drive was the last place 23-year-old Nicole was seen. Just three days before she was murdered, Surveillance cameras show her walking across the parking lot into the convenience store. Detectives say as time goes by, people's memories fade, and it gets more difficult to solve these cases. However, DNA technology is improving. So there's the optimism that maybe some, some of the evidence that we found may, if we get a suspect, lead us to confirming or denying that person was involved. Her family lives in fear, knowing her killer is still out there, and others could be in danger. That's definitely it a huge concern for us, another family having to lose someone. Because I, I, I don't understand how someone could be that aggressively angry and just be a one-time thing. Yeah, I mean, it, it was... Violence. It really was such a rage-filled crime. She hoped to become a psychologist so that she could work with other young people who needed support. Um, she hoped to fall in love and marry and have children of her own. That future was denied her. Detective Jackson says they've spoken to potential suspects, but those leads turned up empty and no arrests have been made. He says they are still submitting items for DNA testing and are hopeful that new technology might provide some answers. If you have any information on what might have happened to Nicole Coleman, call Crime Stoppers at 512-472-TIPS. That's 8477. You can remain anonymous and a reward of up to $1,000 may be available for information that leads to an arrest. Let's hope and pray that Nicole's family can find out who took their daughter's life. If you lived in the area, or if you've heard people talking about who could have done this to Nicole or what happened to her, let the authorities know. Small details can close cases. Mm -hmm.